Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Ashley and this is Ashley Talks Movies. Welcome to my channel. So apparently Disney is working on a sequel to its live action remake of The Lion King. Yes, this is a sequel that no one asked for. But it's not surprising, this news, because, um, you know, The Lion King, the live action remake, live action remake, um, made a lot of money for Disney. In fact, it made $1.6 billion at the box office. So yeah, Disney was going to try to recapture some of that monetary magic. Uh, and it seems like they're already uh, developing a sequel. What is interesting about this news is that they've chosen Moonlight director Barry Jenkins to direct the sequel. Um, I like Barry Jenkins as a director. Um, I really enjoyed Moonlight. I thought it was a great film. But it's going to be interesting to see what he does with this. I don't know that he has any experience with um, you know, animation or visual effects, uh, things like that which, you know, will be for this film because they're going to be using the, I kept saying live action remake, but um, the Lion King used, it, used photorealistic CGI. Um, so that's going to be used in the sequel. But yeah, so, I mean, Barry Jinx is great. I, we'll see what he does with it. My real question following this news is what's the story going to be? Um, is it going to be, you know, an original story or are they going to do a sequel similar to the sequel that, that they had for the animated film? Um, I hope not. I hope not. I, I really hope they go, I hope they use this opportunity to go in a completely different direction. Um, craft an original story because my, my biggest problem with the 2019, uh, Lion King remake was it was basically with the exception of a couple of tweaks here and there, it was basically a shot-for-shot -shot remake of the 1994 original animated film. So to me, there was no real creativity there. I mean, they literally used shot-for-shot. -shot. Um, the photorealistic CGI was gorgeous. I mean, it looked amazing. But beyond that, there was nothing new to the story. And in fact, when the characters started talking, um, they just, they were expressionless. I felt like that film lost a lot of the magic that existed in the animated film. So I, I for one, not really looking forward to a sequel to that. But given that they have hired Barry Jenkins to direct this project, um, maybe it's a signal that they are going to go in a different direction. I hope so. I really hope so because I did not like the remake. Um, but yeah, so, you know, we're getting a Lion King 2. Um, so I don't know. I, I, there's definitely an audience out there for it. There is. I mean, as much as I didn't like the remake, um, again, it made $1.6 billion. And I, there's plenty of people who did like it. So, yeah, there's definitely an audience for this sequel. But, um, th this is still in development. Like, nothing else has been said about this project. There's, there, there's no release date. There's no... There's no uh, time frame for when production is going to start. Um, they haven't even released an official like synopsis or storyline of what this what this film is going to be. Um, so so I will be you know monitoring and see what happens because obviously I'm now a little interested um, given that you know Barry Jenkins is uh, being brought on board. Um, but yeah, just more live action, live action, more live action remakes uh, from Disney. And uh, this one is going to be a sequel to The Lion King remake. Those are my thoughts on The Lion King 2 news. Let me know what you think about the news in the comment section below. Are you excited about Baron Jenkins being director? What do you think uh, the storyline will be? Uh, let me know. Share your thoughts with me. And while you're here, like this video, share this video, and don't forget to subscribe. <music>